Hello everyone! Happy International Lolita Day for the summer of 2022! For myself this year, I wasn't able to make any plans with my friends because work has been keeping me busy. So to celebrate, I just decided to have a little home celebration with some egg sandwiches and delivery ordered my dessert as well. It feels a little sad to not be able to go out and enjoy things with my friends, but sadly, that is the reality of adult life. There's always issues with scheduling and well, eventually you'll just learn to accept that and it's completely fine to just celebrate things by yourself. I'm curious to know if you're celebrating International Lolita Day with a community or if you're just by yourself like me. For today's coordinate, I decided to try a new thing with my makeup. I haven't done any sort of fun makeup for a while, and this took longer than I expected. As usual, the makeup products that I used will be listed in the description box down below. What's super fun about today's makeup is the rhinestones. It was a little slow to put them on, but they really add some bling to the look. Today's main piece is from Baby the Starshine Bright, and it is Alice's Mirage in Paradox. I literally haven't worn this dress for about two years now, so I popped it on for today, and I decided to pair it with rabbit ears because I thought it would look super cute, especially with the bonnet. So for my delivery desserts, I purchased from a local Korean cafe called Urban Plant and they have the best bingsu that I absolutely adore. I picked up a drink called the Pong Pong Crush Frappe and it's like cereal milk with some puffed wheat on top and I really really like this drink. Plus, they had an option to make it with either soy milk, plant-based milk, any other alternative milk, which made it even friendlier in my stomach. The egg sandwich that I made was also really good. The garlic powder just makes things so much more addictive to me. Like, I just can't imagine my life without garlic. I just can't. Thank you. 
And the usual bingsu that I pick up is the kong bingsu, which has red beans, tteok, condensed milk, and injunmi powder. It's seriously one of my favorites and one that I always recommend to other people. Alright, thanks for watching today's video. I hope that you will enjoy your own International Lolita Day celebrations, and I will see you in the next video. Bye!